healthcare expert, Dr. Rashmi Manjunath, live from Bangalore. Dr. Rashmi Manjunath is a renowned skin specialist, dermatologist in Whitefield, Bangalore. Doctor has over 20 years of experience in the field of dermatology. Today, Dr. Rashmi will share with us on sunscreen and skin care routine. Why should we wear sunscreen every day? Yeah, every day and also more uh, frequently, you know, because it's just not, uh, uh, you know, people say that I just wear a sunscreen, I use a sunscreen and, you know, my skin is supposed to be healthy, but there's something going wrong and all. But the idea is also to use the sunscreen more frequently. How is the effectiveness of sunscreen measured? Uh, yeah, very, very good question. So there are a lot of lab data which are, you know, uh, you know, conducted. I was also, uh, I had the opportunity where I was part of uh, uh, many of these studies wherein uh, we had conducted uh, tests depending upon the different sunscreen and how does it uh, you know react to the sun when the you know the the subject is actually exposing themselves to sun we've done internal analysis so the skin has been actually taken off and it has been microscopically analyzed and things like that I put sunscreen on my lips yeah very 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 important right. uh, lip is again a very um, uh, you know, very, very different uh, kind of uh, structure than the face. And uh, it's a very sensitive structure. Again, many products which you are using, you are also using a lot of products on the face, like on the lip, like lipsticks and all that, which can have an impact. So yes, there are sunscreens which are made especially for the lip. So pick up those products which are made for the lip. People who love to cover them up with clothing but do not use sunscreen because they feel that clothing is giving them better protection from the sun. So why not just cover up with clothing instead of using sunscreen is their uh, you know, uh, point of discussion. So please elaborate on this a little more. Yeah, so clothing will uh, be just like a physical form. Right. Uh, it's just going to probably reflect and protect you from uh, the light or whatever, but it is also very important that whatever light gets absorbed and the SPF of each clothing varies. Uh, we do have uh, protective clothing right now, which uh, has an SPF of 50 or a cap, which has an SPF of 50, but they are just going to protect. They're going to be just in a physical aspect, but what you need is something, the light, when it goes through, it is, it should be able to, uh, you know, prevent that uh, deeper uh, penetration of the light and the damage which uh, light is causing. So that is where our chemical sunscreens come into picture. But, you know, always when we are stepping out, we should use a sunscreen um, to step out and give it some time for the sunscreen to get activated. It's not that we apply the sunscreen and immediately we, you know, go venture out. So give it that uh, required duration to get activated. The second thing is there are a lot of sunscreens which also help in healing the skin. So look into those uh, products also uh, in terms of, uh, you know, helping your skin uh, manage the damage which is caused by light per se. So we have uh, sunscreens which are blue light. We have sunscreens for acne prone skin. We have sunscreens um, which are healing. So they, and there are sunscreens with the moisturizers which are available. Like subscribe and press the bell icon thanks for watching to know more about on sunscreen in skin regimen watch the full talk show with dr rashmi manjunath from bangalore on beautiful spotless skin facebook page